Hello, I'm Dr Beth Colby from Talk Mental Health and I work as a psychiatrist in London. Rabbit syndrome is a movement disorder characterised by involuntary vertical rhythmic movements of the mouth and lips. It is like a tremor and resembles the chewing movements of a rabbit. The tongue is not involved. The movements are typically at a frequency of 4 to 6 hertz. The disorder is an extrapyramidal side effect of typical, i.e. first generation, the older antipsychotic medication, such as haloperidol. It usually occurs in people who have been on the medication for years. However, reports have been made of patients who have been on the medication for as short a time as a week. The prevalence is 1.5 to 4.4 of patients who are on typical antipsychotic medication. There have been reports of rabbit syndrome occurring in patients on atypical antipsychotic medication, such as risperidone, olanzapine, clozapine and aripiprazole. Rabbit syndrome may be diagnosed as tardive dyskinesia, but there are several differences between the two movement disorders caused by typical antipsychotic medication. In tardive dyskinesia, the tongue is not involved and the movements may not be just vertical. The movements in tardive dyskinesia are not as rapid or rhythmic as those in rabbit syndrome. Whilst the movements of rabbit syndrome are like a fine tremor, those of tardive dyskinesia are more like lip smacking and chewing. Oral tardive dyskinesia may be stopped voluntarily, but people with rabbit syndrome are unable to control their movements as it is totally involuntary. We do not have a good understanding of the neuropathology of rabbit syndrome, but there are a few ways of trying to treat the condition. The first is to reduce the dose of the typical antipsychotic medication, depending on the psychotic symptoms. One may switch over to an atypical antipsychotic from a typical antipsychotic to try and reduce rabbit syndrome. The other treatment is to commence an anticholinergic drug, such as procyclidin. It is important to continue the anticholinergic drug, as if it is then withdrawn, the rabbit syndrome symptoms may recur. Thank you for listening. Bye for now.